What is up guys, Madden Mobile Elite back with another video, and today I'm going to be doing uh, a team update, show you guys what my team's been doing, uh, who I have, and I'm going to do some, some pro packs, probably just like 100k and some pro packs, so let's do this pro packs real first, real quick here first guys, um, later in the video I will um, show you my team. Store is pretty slow today, it seems. I'm taking a while to load up this pro pack. Sorry, sorry about that, guys. It looks like I'm having some communication issues with the app, and there it finally goes. Alright, nothing there. Next pack. Nothing. But yeah, I've been pulling some elite collectibles for the Super Bowl Legends set lately. And um, in these packs... Oh, was we at a 90 overall Joe Thomas. Alright. Oh, I thought that was another elite. I know that can't happen. <laughs> but yeah, I've been getting um, a bunch of those elite collectibles. And I've been selling them and making a bunch of, bunch of money. So that's been pretty cool. And guys, uh, my Super Bowl Legend video has, like, over 3,000 views. And guys, I just want to, and it has, uh, I just want to say that I never expected anything like this when I started my channel a couple weeks ago. It's just all moving so fast. And I just want to say thank you to everybody that subscribed. And thank you for the positive motivation. As I love making videos, and I want to keep making videos. So, thank you. That's all. I just want to say thank you. As we get another 90 Joe Thomas. Now, what I want to say uh, about elite players right now, for some reason, elite players that aren't like 96 and above are going super cheap right now for some odd reason. So what I would suggest, I would suggest holding on to elite players for a while until the market balances out again. Like, for some reason, elite players just are selling for so cheap. Like, team of the week players are selling for like 20,000 elites. And as we get a Chandler Jones, all right, guys, this opening is nice. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I would suggest holding on to your elites. That's what I'm doing, at least. I'm starting to just have a collection of them going. Just a collection of elite players. And then I'm going to sell them all once the, hopefully, one value of elite players goes back up. Because you may have noticed the same thing. This value has gone down. Overall, everything has gone down. Even collectibles, trophies have gone down in value. Don't know why, but they have. <clears throat> so, this will be one of the last packs. But we've already pulled three elites, guys. And 100k in pack opening and then three elites. I will take that any day. Let's just do this last one. Then we'll get to the team update. All right. As we get a 90 overall, Joe Flacco football outsiders. Wow, guys, that was crazy 100k. <laughs> well, anyways, right after that, we're going to get right into my team update. So I am a 96 overall now with a 97, 96, 95 layout of overalls. Um, As you can see, my offensive line, pretty nice. It's 92 is the worst, and I got a 96 is the best. That, um, I bought, the only players I bought from this whole entire offense is the Clint Bowling and the Bo Jackson. Besides that, I did everything else on my own, either pulling in packs or doing sets, so I'm pretty proud of that. Um, so yeah, and the Bo Jackson, he is by far like the best running back in the game. Look at his stats, 99 speed and 99 strength. And a hundred trucking without any additional anything. And then he has he, he can't even go any higher with strength when um when I have a cord that adds strength. So it's just in his agility, his acceleration, ninety seven, ninety nine. Guys, this card is too good. I mean his stats are just insane. Uh so I'd recommend using him. And then I'm using this ninety nine John Elway and I sold the um the Montana, just because I really like his stats. He's fa he's way faster, and yet his throw power and his accuracy is still decent. 
So that's why I use that. And then I have the Marshawn Lynch, which I used to be using as my main running back, but don't anymore. He's just not nearly as good as Bo Jackson. And my wide receivers, Dion Branches, look at this. I have him upgraded to have a 99 catching, so he catches the ball every single time. Unless a defender really gets in his way. And then Isaac Bruce. Neither of them sell for a lot, but they're worth so much on your team. Moving on to my defense. Um, the only players I bought here, I bought... Well, no, I even did Jack Lambert in a set. So the only player I bought here... Actually, only Richard Sherman. Richard Sherman down there in the dime position is the only player I bought on this whole thing. So I'm pretty proud of that too, guys. So I've gotten my team to the point where it is uh, without buying anything or too many things. Uh, it's all on my own, so that's pretty cool. Um, and then that Earl Thomas the third, he goes for so much money. I was debating selling him, but I decided I'm going to keep him just because he's such an amazing card and there's like barely any good safeties. So that's my defense, guys. Um, linebackers are just really good. 99, 99, 96, 94. Pretty darn good if you ask me. And then my special teams. If anybody knows how to get a better overall special teams, please let me do know down in the comments below. Because I have a nut. I couldn't find any punters better than 85. And my kick returners are 96. 96, to my knowledge, two of the best in the game. And then I have the best kicker, Justin Tucker. So if you have any knowledge on how to get a better special teams, please let me know. And I've already tried the Corderell Patterson method, and that didn't work out. That just dropped my offense too. Uh, 95. My special teams did go up to 197, but my offense dropped, and I don't want that. So if you have any ideas, just let me know in the comments. And that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you, thank you so much for watching, and leave a like for those four elites and 100k in opening. That was amazing. Um, but yeah, thanks, guys. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. See you guys. Peace.